hello guys welcome back to another basic java programming tutorial in today's episode we are going to learn about another important concepts in java called dynamic method dispatch the dynamic method is dispatch is a mechanism in which a call to an overridden method is resolved at a runtime instead of compile time so here i'm going to show you an example that will demonstrate what you mean by dynamic method dispatch this is how Java acquired the runtime polymorphism. So here I am going to show you an example that will demonstrate what you mean by dynamic method dispatch. So create a class, class A. Now create another class called class B. now create under class class C and class A contain a method called display public void display print some message system dot out dot print lm hello from class A method Okay, now here class B extends class A. Also class C also extends class A. Okay, and here I'm going to place the same method in class B and class C. So here we have three classes, class A, class B and class C. Class A is the parent of class B and class C. And that contain a method with the same name and signature called the display method. Okay. And here allow from class B method. And here allow from class C method. Now inside the main class, I'm going to create object of class A, class B and class C. new class A now create an object of class B B equal to new class B also create object of class C equal to new class C okay and also create a reference variable for class A that is the parent class okay now here I am going to make some assignment operations first one A equal to A here A is a reference to class A that is not an object and here I make an assignment operation for the reference variable A I assign an object of class A now by using that reference variable I call the display method okay now here I am going to make another assignment operation a equal to small b now here a is a reference to class type class a but here I assign an object of class b into reference variable a and by using that reference variable I call the display method again and here I assign object of class C and by using that reference variable called the display method so this is called the dynamic method dispatch this will invoke the display method version inside class A this will invoke the display method version inside class B and this will invoke the display method version in class C and here Java determine which version of the display method is invoked at the runtime not at compile time that is called dynamic method dispatch so we can check the program run the program here we have all the versions of display method hello from class A method class B method and class C method this is how Java established the runtime polymorphism and this is called the dynamic method dispatch in Java I hope you understand the concept thank you thank you for watching see you in the next episode